I don't think BBH is concerned about the middle class working family. Um, they can gripe and groan about their own financial situation, but we know that BBH is actually owned by a huge conglomerate that owns other companies, and so I don't think they're hurting. BBH isn't hurting, but the middle class actor is. It's really disappointing when people decide to abandon the commitments that they've made. I mean, to me, I, I wouldn't be friends with people who don't live their word with me in my life, and it's really disappointing that they would decide to just abandon that for, frankly, corporate greed. The only reason to leave the contract is because you don't want to pay people and treat people professionally. They think that my doing a job, using my image and my, uh, my talent to further their products and their clients' agendas um, is not worth me being safe at work, not safe, not not worth me being healthy as an individual or my being paid a living wage. To say that that is not their concern is to say that they have absolutely no regard for me as a professional. And I don't know, I don't know what to say about that other than that's, that's so wrong. We live in a time when I think big companies want to make more money on the backs of their workers. And so if we don't have those protections in place, um, we could be in real danger of not being able to support ourselves or our families and things like that. I've been working really hard to do this, to do this well, and suddenly you want me to work for this rate and you want me to not have that money go towards my pension and my health insurance, things that are gonna support my family. Um, I wanna be, I wanna continue to be a working actor and uh, if, if you want me to work on sale, I'm not on sale. I'm, I'm, I'm this amount, I'm this agreed amount that we have, we have mutually agreed upon a compensation for our talent and our face and our ability to interpret your message and suddenly you want me to go on sale and I'm, I'm not on sale.